guys, it's Jody, and today I'm foraging, or actually harvesting, fennel that is in my yard. So I came outside with the clippers and something bit me, which I think is a wasp because I do have a ton of fennel here and the wasp keep um, coming over. But so do the butterflies. So I'm not going to take more than a fourth of the fennel because I do want the butterflies and even the wasp to have something um, to munch on. But anyway, fennel is really good. I had a little bit of a stomach ache on Sunday, so I came over to the plant and I just cut off like, I wanna say like six of these big umbrellas and I put them in the cooler when we were out vending and as I didn't feel good, I was just pinching off the seeds, eating them. And then I also took two big umbrellas and I, made just poured boiling water over made him tea and it really really helped me feel a lot better but what i'm doing today is i'm going to cut off some of these umbrellas and as i like to call them i'm sure there's more of a scientific name and i'm going to put them in my brown bag and then i'm going to hang the brown bag in my herb room i have a a little setup where i hang things to dry so i'm going to hang the fennel and the reason that I'm not going to hang this upside down is because when fennel is really dry the seeds just kind of pop out so I really like to keep these in the bag uh, so back to the wasp um, sting so what I did is I put plantain which is a plant that we find in the garden right on the I just bent down picked up a plantain leaf chewed it up um, and plantain not the banana but the herb, I just chewed up that herb, put it right on that sting. And I have to say within a minute, I felt tons better. Definitely was a lot worse than a bee sting, I'll tell you that. 